Hi, I'm Pete Eddie Fatsex, and this is how to image glitch using WordPad. Okay, first we're going to want to do is get some photos, or a photo, doesn't matter, I chose Audrey Hepburn, and we're going to glitch this bitch. So, let's get started. Um, we're going to open it with, um, uh, we're going to open it with, um, uh, paint. Then we're gonna go to file, or we're gonna save it. Save as BMP, and we're gonna save it to the desktop or wherever the fuck you want to save it. Save that to desktop. All right, we close this bullshit, minimize this bullshit, and then we're gonna open that image again, and we're gonna open it with, um, we're gonna open it with a uh, WordPad this time. So open with WordPad. Let that shit load because it's kind of a big image. And then we're gonna go to file and save. All right, so now it's glitched. Pretty cool. Now, if you want to glitch it even more, you just go and change the code. You just take some shit out, or you can add some shit. So we'll take some shit out. File, save. And change the color of the neck. So we'll just add some shit. Like, you can add anything like, let's say, shit, 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 shit. And then we're gonna file and save. And, and make some more shit. Make some purple shit. Anyways, let's try another photo. Um, I have noticed that, like, different colors um, produces different results. So let's try a black and white one. Um, we're gonna open it with um, paint again, and we're gonna go to to um, save as BMP. We're gonna save it to the desktop or wherever the fuck you wanna save it again. X out of that, minimize this, and open it. Or just go ahead and open it and open it with. Um, WordPad, and then go to File, and Save, and now we just glitch that shit. So now you got some, um, retro 80s VHS, um, tracking static stuff that you can use as a, um, as whatever what am I what am I thinking of you use it for uh, a pattern around your font or whatever in Photoshop anyways let's try another one let's go to this and let's open up another one let's see so you'll notice as the colors we try a different color one let's go ahead and try this one and we'll open it with paint and save it as BMP. Save it to the desktop. And we're gonna exit out of that. And we're gonna minimize that. And we're gonna open this with um, WordPad. And give it some time to lose a big image. File and save. If, oh, wait a minute. It's, it's already open in another thing. But it did it anyway. So, see, sometimes the images won't show up right, so you just open them with, um, paint again. So open with paint. And there it is. That's pretty cool. So let's try one more. Um, let's out of that. And next out of that bullshit, go back to this folder. Let's try. Let's try this one. And we're open it with uh, doo -doo 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 -doo, paint, and go to save as BMP, and let's go to desktop or wherever you want to save it, and we'll exit out of that down this and open it again open it with uh, wordpad 
and larger images take longer to load. It's more code. And there we go. And we got to file and save. Now let's see what that looks like. Let's see, once again, it's doing that shit. So you just open it with uh, paint to view it. Paint. That looks pretty cool. Anyways, in this tutorial, and uh, that's how uh, we glitch a bitch.